In this area of Texas is where officers spent three weeks looking and searching for escaped convict murderer Gonzalez Lopez. So what happened during this time? On May 12th, Lopez was initially being transported with 15 other inmates from just outside Gatesville to Huntsville for medical appointments. But something happened during the trip here in Centerville. This is where officials say Lopez got out of his shackles, cut through a metal barrier, stabbed a guard, took control of the bus, and drove off. One of the guards shot the back tires, forcing Lopez to crash and then run away into Leon County. He is a very dangerous person. On May 15th, officials marked this area of 100 square miles as where they believed Lopez was hiding. Yo, we saw the inmate. Oh my God. On May 17th, some new video surfaced, shot from someone in a passing car, showing a blurry but later confirmed video of Lopez running away on the day of his escape. It wasn't until June 2nd that this manhunt took a tragic turn. Officials said they believed Lopez stole weapons and a truck from a ranch in Centerville, killing one adult and four children before driving away. Please know that he cannot run forever. And I would urge Lopez to give up. Then later that night in San Antonio, authorities said officers spotted the truck at a mall. They followed him south to Atascosa County. That's where officers eventually spiked Lopez's tires, forcing him to crash. Officials said he fired several shots at officers before they eventually fired back, killing Lopez. Those officers very swiftly uh, shot and killed uh, Lopez, bringing this whole ordeal to an end. In North Texas, I'm Jay Wallace.